Hey, good evening, everybody. I just want to try to touch base on something a little off subject of what I usually talk about, but this kind of needs to get out because I think that there is a definite change of times, and I want to get this out because there are a lot of people that I know that are into this stuff. Travis Scott's concert that took place in Texas over the weekend where a bunch of people were supposedly trampled and or mauled by the crowd, there's reports on the ground from other people that that state something way different. The mainstream media is not covering what really happened. There's, there's by witnesses, there were hundreds of people that were killed, not just eight. Um, it goes to one of the police officers that was working the events that said that he had to be brought back by Narcan because he felt some kind of weird prick on his neck. Not, from a needle. Uh, let's not get to anything to construed here. So anyways, that was a little bit of a lighter note, but this is serious. This is very serious because it, Nobody knows exactly what happened. The whole time this was taking place during the concert, Travis Scott never actually stopped to try to to slow the crowd down, to see what was going on. He egged the crowd on. He went into a satanic mumble and like almost like in a trance. And actual concert venue people had to get him off the stage, stop the concert. He was not even worried about it. He just kept rolling with it. Um... He's been known to have outbreaks like this before, outbursts where he's had the crowd attack other people in the crowd when something there was a, an issue where somebody tried to take his shoe when he was crowd surfing. If you're going to jump off the stage and surf in the crowd, you everybody knows that's done this. You take everything out of your pockets. You don't have anything in your pockets. I mean, anybody that's done any kind of like concerts or crowd surfing knows if you're going to crowd surf, you do not, you know, so if something happens and you get something missing, you, you just, you're just lost. That's what you get. You learn not to do that no more. So but he had a bunch of people attack some of the crowd members attack his other crowd members because of what happened. There's video of that. I've got to find a link. But anyhow, long story short, what was really going on was a satanic ritual that a lot of people believe took place because there was a lot of people who just all of a sudden that fell out. They don't know what happened. He went into a trance. The Travis Scott went into a trance and started mumbling all this weird satanic words, egging the crowd on. There was people on the ambulances trying to they were twerking. People on ambulances were jumping on the ambulances. He was telling the crowd not to let the ambulances through. And all the people were on top of them. The ambulances twerking, blocking what was supposed to happen. And Travis Scott was allowing it and making sure that that happened. There's actual people have got it on phone and video where he was saying, don't let them through, don't let them through, F these people. And people were dying out there in the middle of the, the field. This property is owned by... Uh, Bush Gardens, I think. I've got to look into that because this is all sort of breaking. But anyhow, a long story short, media is not really reporting what happened. They don't. They won't show what the crowd was doing to the ambulances and the people trying to save these people's lives. This happened at Travis Scott's concert in Texas, and I want everybody to wake up to think about what they're buying into when they buy into this kind of music. Because if a man's going to sit there and tell you what he's going to do to your old lady when you're not there or when he's going to take her backstage and have his way with her and you're going to buy his CD, you better, uh, and you're, then you're going to buy a ticket to go watch him tell you how he's going to do this to your old lady, you're asking for it. So if you're going to be into this kind of stuff, think twice about what you sign up for. Um, I'm really disturbed by the whole thing. And if anybody, if, if he gets away with this, there, there sets a whole other precedence for whatever people can do when they're their elites. But you're going to find out that it was a lot more than eight people that died. And it wasn't because of a crowd stampede. Something really bad happened. And if it doesn't come out, you need to go to your, your media source and find out why they're reporting such awful, terrible lies to you because this was some really bad stuff. So just to get this back to summary so everybody knows where we're at, Tom, uh, Tom Scott, uh, Tim Scott, Tom Scott, the rapper in Texas. I'm sorry, I get so worked up. It just bothers me. This happened in Texas last night. So anyhow, uh, please like, subscribe, and share, and get the word out about what's happening, because we got to put a stop to this. We've got to save our children. These children—they're being. This is all being sold to our kids. They're signing up for it. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you so much for tuning in. Thank everybody for just being here. God is in control.